Let's talk about how to add multiple plugins on multiple channels very quickly in Reaper using effects chains. I'm Keith from No Label No Producer No Limits.com. Let's dive right in. Okay, I'm working on a project here and let's assume I decide I want to add multiple plugins to every track or at least a lot of tracks. Let's say a channel strip plugin, a tape emulation plugin, and a saturation plugin. Well, how do we do that? It's simple. My first step is to click on the effects button on any channel or track and add the plugins I want to add. Let's say tape emulation. We'll add tape recorder from Toucan and set it how we like it. Let's add a channel strip plugin. Here's some channel also from Toucan and I'm dragging that to first in the chain and lastly let's add saturation. JS saturation and let's say we set it at 12 percent. So now we have these three effects on the channel. Now I'm going to go up here to effects and click save effects chain. Let's call this channel and save it. Once you've created the effects chain, it's easy to add it to multiple channels. Simply select the tracks and you can do that by left clicking on a track and then if you want contiguous tracks, for instance all these blue ones, just hold down shift and left click again. But if you want tracks that are not next to each other, you can choose one here, hold down control or that would be command on a Mac, click on whatever other tracks that you want to add. Now that we've got those tracks selected, we click on any effects button, make sure we have effects chains selected, find the channel effects chain, right click, and add two selected tracks. Now if we click on the effects button of any of the channels we had selected, you could see it has the effects on it. And there they are, we can check, and they are set just like I had them set. There are other ways to make effects chains. I can left click and then hold down control. That would be command on a Mac and select two of these for instance and go to effects and instead of save effects chain save selected FX as chain and then I can add that to channels just the way that we saw before. If I have effects that I want to load up on every new track I can save them as default for new tracks and when I start a new track those will automatically be loaded. I help independent musicians make better home recordings. So if that's up your alley, it makes sense for you to subscribe. Do it now while you're thinking of it. Also, if you'll like and comment, it helps me keep the channel going. See you next time. I'm Keith from No Label, No Producer, NoLimits.com. Bye-bye.